What is up everybody, Mana here with Daily Circle of the Content, welcome to the 21st episode of Void Ray Disruptors. We need to take some revenge on my opponents because the previous episode was not too kind to me. I lost two games, 1-1, one, one. we need to start winning. And all of a sudden, I'm playing Protoss vs Protoss, I'm doing an intro and you know what? <laughs> Plot twist! It's a freaking Protoss vs Protoss! And I'm doing a Wall of versus Leg Leg vs a Terran, okay. Well, we'll try to work, uh, work this out somehow, some way. I'm gonna play probably... <laughs> I'm thinking about just opening up a double gateway anyway, or maybe we can just kind of lure him to make... Uh, to make Adepts. I could start with a Stargate then, and the Voidus are going to be pretty good versus the Adepts. We'll see how this works. He's already scouting me with a probe. But that was kind of a weird angle, I think, of the probe. Or maybe I'm saying things. No, never mind. It's just no proxies. Okay, he will definitely be confused by the Wall of. That's 100%. Now, how can I make this uh, actually work? Because I did confuse myself already in the very beginning of the video. That's not ideal. But I don't think it's too terrible. We can definitely try to make something work. Okay, there's the double gateway for my opponent. I'll immediately start the gas mining. I'm gonna go for the pylon on the low ground, I think. Let's see, is he gonna, is he gonna be aggressive or not? It's going to be very difficult to defend the potential, like, uh, four stalker move or stuff like that, if he's going to go for it. I think I might even, like, I I started with an Oracle. One time. Versus a uh, trigger. I'm not sure if I should allow myself to do an Oracle opening here as well, because I think it might save me. For now, we'll just stay right there. Let's go for the target immediately. I wonder if he's gonna make adept now, after he sees the Stargate. He's probably making Stalkers now. If I had to take a wild guess. I'll probably invest into very quick for- At least it's three pylons on his side of the map, which is really nice. I don't think I'm going to be under- Oh, it's a sentry! Hey, this is so good for me! Sentry is actually good! Nice! Nice, 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 nice. That means it's like going to be very little pressure from his side. Love it! Absolutely love it. It's probably the best case scenario for me, considering the circumstances. I have one stalker. Let's make a void ray. Wait, I never made a third pylon. Not ideal. Uh, let's move out with the stalker. I can start the void ray production as soon as my pylon finishes. He moving out? No, he's not moving. I wonder if he kept the probe at home or not. Let's start the void ray production. Yeah, this is going to be a very weird game for sure. Definitely not standard. By the way, that it's it's going so far. I was not expecting to be like allowed to make a free expansion, like he's allowing me right now. Let's get a second strike. He's gonna see it very quickly. So be it. But I need to start my void reproduction as soon as possible. <coughs> I would love to see what he's doing with the first void ray. He sees the double stargate now. It's well, to be expected with uh, with the sentry opening like that. I could have waited with the second target by a bit, but to be honest, like I said, I need to start my void production as soon as possible. I'll move out with the void ray now, to the other side of the map. If I get a probe, so be it, but I really don't think I will. It will be a very big surprise, simply because my opponent has uh, already spotted that I'm starting with the target with the probe. And uh, the reaction for that is to immediately make a battery at, uh, at home to prevent the oracle from doing damage. So the void ray doesn't have the same DPS as the Oracle, so if I find even a single probe damage, it's good. This is basically just a scouting void right here. Probably going to be seeing a Twilight Council in just a moment. Hello? Okay. No battery, huh? He just doesn't care. Two probes are really very good. I wanted to be greedy for the third probe, but definitely not, not worth the risk. Okay, here we go, starting with the... Third void right now, four void right even. Third one is finishing. I think getting forged would not be that bad of an idea. Let's get another pine. We need to get plus one. Okay, he's still staying at home with the Stalkerinos. I'm surprised that he hasn't even attempted a uh, adept shade in run by. One would say. Oh, it's a very early third base. Very early third base. Okay, so I can move out with my void rays. I'll go here. We go free void at home. Okay. He sees that I don't have units at home. I wonder if he's gonna be prepared for the move out. 
since his third base is so quick, I am expecting him to uh, not have as many units. But if he has all his units in the main base, more than the three stalkers that he showed me before, it's going to be uh, quite hard for me. But he might not have them. Let's see. We might be able to find a little bit of damage here. I have a recall available. If necessary, we can maybe kill some stalkers. He has blink already, though. He's double forge. That's double forge. I don't know if I agree with that, but I guess I guess it's, it's, it's the way it's going to go. All right. Hmm. So he's playing extremely greedy. He knows he's not going to break me. This is exciting. I was not expecting this game. This is going to be a very different PvP than what I'm used to playing. Always on my uh, back foot, always trying to defend. I think this time I want to be a little bit more aggressive, but not sure how much more aggressive I can be. There's not much. I can do. He's gonna blink, right? Okay. Does it? But it's fine. Get a pylon. I should be fine. I want to say. The fact that I have z absolutely zero detection is also pretty sick. All right, let's get the gas in the first base. This is going to go late game for sure. Uh, the time has absolutely passed for me to do any kind of damage. It's up to me to be kind of greedy right now and not get supply blocked like a gold league player that I am. Let's get the plus two and the void wave speed. If I can survive to these upgrades and having uh, have my third base completely saturated, I have hopes for this game that it can actually go well for me. For now, I am definitely uh, read well by my opponent. Like, my opponent knows exactly what he's playing against, I think. Get this robot. Uh, I need some observers and we need to start making disruptors as well. Since he, go he, since he is going for double forge... Oh, let's cancel the shield upgrade. Since he's going for double forge, that means he's staying on ground toss. So I need to get to the disruptor count as soon as possible. To get some cannons, some batteries. Ideally, I would like to get a battery and a cannon in my main base as well. We can even patrol one of my voidways here. Should be enough for me to deal with the harassment. Let's put some spotter pylons around the map. Uh, get a second observer. And we have eight void rays with speed. I hope he's not moving out, because if he is, this is a bad move out for me. Let's see, it's like a pylon here and a pylon here on the south. A very good vision. My rubble bay is about to finish. He's playing very, very passive. Surprisingly passive. And that really worries me. Oh, I saw some. I saw something, but I'm not sure if this is. I don't think it was uh, anything aggressive. He's. He does have a fourth already. Yeah, it's just a. Just a hallucination. Okay, he can kill the four just now. He's not gonna get two two. Let's go. Delay the two two. No two two for you. Yes. That's right. He doesn't have that many stalkers there. I'm really surprised by the low amount, but he has expanded like crazy. Can I attack the fourth? There's some stalkers there. He has one one. He has storms? I think. Wait, he has like no stalkers. Can he defend this? He has like no stalkers, literally. They're gonna make storm. In PvP. I mean versus void is like the only way that it is good. But it's not very good. You can just avoid it. He's blinking forward. Uh, I lost two void rays, that's not good. I can do like... Oh, wait, what? He has still stuff here? I thought it's the uh, main part of his army there. Okay. That was not ideal. But I do have... A fourth base on the way. It really wasn't that bad. It really wasn't that bad. He did lose a lot of energy on his uh, uh, High Templars already. But we need to secure the fourth. Let's get the plus three attack already. The fact that I delayed his upgrade by so much is so good for me. I would love to get a second uh, robotics facility, though. Okay. Can we do something here? He's making cannons. Can we kill this? I think we can kill this. Like, I'm gonna lose some voidways here. Okay. Let's just back off. I lost, I don't know, one voidway? Two voidways? That was very good for me. That was excellent. Okay. We're looking good. We're looking good. Let's get a fifth base then. I like this. I like where this is going. For me. Especially because of the upgrades. The plus three voids are going to be so good. Once I get to that count. And he's allowing me to expand freely as well at the same time. Oh. Finally killed my observer. 
Uh, let's send one to the north side, I suppose. Let's get one more robot. So it's gonna be five Stargaze, three robots for now. I have, oh, we have four disruptors. Is this a good time to move out? I've never had this game like that in PvP, I think. I was always like trying to defend like Chardos, Zealot, Ar Archon attacks. Stuff like this, but I never had like a camping ground Protoss. <laughs> I'm a bit stressed. Because the game is going well for me, but it's going like too well, you know what I mean? Like sometimes things are too good to be true. And I'm, I'm not exactly sure what to do. Okay, he's moving out to like some Chardos. We need to prepare some defenses. Five disruptors is a lot. We can probably go through the middle. I don't think going like through here is better for me. Because I, oh, I can get flanked easily, I think. Let's see. I have five disruptors. Should be enough. Oh, Tempest! What? We're playing Tempest? Okay, this is not what I expected. Oh, no. I've never even seen the, the transition. Okay, this, this just complicates the thing so much better for him. Oh, uh, I don't need the robots. Okay, I, I have no idea what to do in this situation. I've never been in this situation before. Storms are going to be so good versus the Voidus. The Voidus are good versus Tempest, only if I can get on top of them. But he has Storms and Archons? I mean... Hmm. Let's try! I, I don't know. I really don't know. I'm quite confused. I have very good upgrades though. That's, that's uh, quite positive for me. Okay, kill this. That's good. And maybe kill some... Archons? Oh, wow. Nice snipe. Really nice snipe. I think we can be more aggressive with the Void Race then. Let's get some servers out on the map. We need to get the shield upgrades now. Uh, five disruptor. Okay, what? Oh, it's an Oracle. Okay, never mind. Oracle is no threat to me. Get more uh, Stargates, I suppose. What am I even playing? We can catch his uh, Tempest production for sure. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm gonna come here. Yes, yes, Storm. Kill the Tempest. Let's go. I'm not afraid of storms. Look at the Void Rays go! Kill the Fleet Beacon. Okay, we can... Def yeah, plus three Void Rays, man. Look at this. No storms for you. Okay, he has storms now. Oh, back off, back off. Okay. I'll have to recall soon. That was a very good trade for me. Just back off, back off, back off. Kill the probes here. Recall these. Look at this, look at this, look at this. The Disruptor run by. We're ready. Are you ready? Are you ready? Look at this. Boop, 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 boop. Oh! oh my god! <laughs> oh, that was wonderful. That's exactly what I needed in my life today. Okay. That puts a smile on my face. All right. Let's move out with the Voidus again. We kill a significant portion of his army already. Or economy as well. He has so many bases. I cannot even saturate all of them. I need more Stargates, I think. The Voidus are doing so well here. Okay, he's still trying to camp through all of it. Let's get a base here. We can definitely attack. This should be good now. So many Archons. He doesn't have that many Tempests now, so... We can kind of like zone him out of the Disruptors. Okay, looking good. He cannot even come close to me. I mean, if he makes carriers, it's gonna be a bit more problematic. Mm, the Disruptors can zone out the High Templars. He's making gateways. Okay, so he's going back to ground us, I'm gonna guess. He has no economy now, though. Go, 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 Void Race, Disruptor flank. Kill the High Templars. Okay, back off, back off, back off. The Templars is too much. That's fine. Barely any Archons. Kill the High Templars. Yes, fine. Back off, back off, back off. I yeah, don't have a very good position. Let's just reinforce. Real quick, one more disruptor shot on the Archon, kill the Archon. Ah, good, good. Look at the Voidring health! Run, my friends! Run to the safety. Okay, we did so much to him. I don't see how he's going to win the next fight. I just need to heal up these Voidrings with a super battery. And I think we're golden. I need to get the uh, Temple Archives for... Sorry, Twilight Council for the... Uh, for the upgrades. Shield upgrades. Let's just use super battery overcharge, so... It heals up a bit quicker, okay. Oh, healed. Let's go. Round... Whichever round it is. Round 3, round 4 of the Void Rate Disruptor attack. Let's go. We should be winning this. I've never played a PvP like this before, this is so exciting. 
Let's kill all the... Oh, unfortunate, my friend. Let's go, boy. Okay, storms. Kill the high Templars. Yes, no storms for you. Let's go. Run in charge! Still no energy for storms here. Let's go. Okay, let's just chase these guys. Okay, I think this is about time to tap out, my friend. Let's go. No camping protoss can defeat me. The voidus are just too much. I was surprised he went like double forge. He went temp archives, double forge, and all of a sudden there's like tempest. Like, why are you investing so much into the ground with the upgrades of double forge and the templars while going to air? Like, if you're going to air, just go air straight up because it's so expensive to go for stalkers, double upgrades, storm, high templar. It's super, super expensive. If you want to go skytos, go skytos. That was exciting. That was exciting PvP. I've never, never played anything like that before. Okay, after game number one, which was quite clean, like, I I mean, to be honest, my opponent pretty much played single player, right? The only thing that he did on the other side of the map was sending hallucinations. He let me grow without any problems. So we had a clean victory, in, and in game number two, we're playing against another Protoss player on Babylon this time, so I can happily go <laughs> and make the low ground expansion. Hopefully, I'll be able to defend this, since I actually have failed in the recent times to defend my one gate expand even on the maps like Babylon and I'm not proud of it because I think a good Protoss player or like a top level Protoss which I like to consider myself top level Protoss but maybe not the not the very best of course I'm not like max max level or like showtime level but I like to consider myself like a, one of the very best uh, European Protosses they all can defend the one gate expands on maps like Babylon versus uh, like uh, gateway pressure or so stuff like that and I have failed to do so in my wrist couple of times. I'm not really sure why. <laughs> it's just I'm, I must have screwed up somewhere so that I'm not fully aware of. And yeah, this guy is not going for one get expand as... Oh, what is this proxy? Wait. Oh, just no wall off. Okay. That's fine. That, uh, yeah, I'm fine with that. Absolutely fine with that. Uh, but he, I think he went back immediately with his probe, which means he wants to make a proxy. Okay. We see at least what he's doing. Let's get this. And make a pylon. I'm gonna make a zealot now instead of probe. Oh no 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 Okay, no nothing not even close man. That probe was never in any danger of dying. Calculated. Uh, there's definitely a second pylon with a I wanna say proxy gateway immediately. And that zealot is going to do the job. He will scout around and he will try to kill the pylon before the cybernetic core units from his gateways are going to be arriving. I need to make a target immediately in my uh, natural base, though. Get this. Scout around. Let's make a stalker as well. Not an adept. I could probably make an adept, but not necessary. Okay, where are you? Where's the proxy? I need to find it. If I don't find it quickly enough, he might actually uh, arrive quick enough to defend this. There is a proxy. I'm 100% I'm certain there is a proxy. I just don't know where. I need to find it. Is it here behind the wall, possibly? Like a battery. Has to be here, be uh, behind the, the rocks, I think. That's where it is, right? No? Where is it? Oh, why? It's going to be problematic in just a moment. I know it is somewhere. Okay, let's go back. We need to go back. Not much else I can do. We just need to see it. It is somewhere. Oh, it's hidden very well. This could be on the left side. Okay, let's move out sneakily with the stalker to the left side. I hope it, I didn't miss it. Okay, pro pro. Here? No? Wow, man, what is what is this guy proxy? Get a battery here. Okay, that's fine. Two stalkers only. At least it's quite far away. It is far away. Like I'm starting to lose hope of fighting it. But it should be fine. Oh, there's freaking Oracle. Man, I swear to god, it's right there. Okay. Well, at least I have an expansion. Can I see if he has an expansion? He must have an expansion then. He's not a learning. Ah! Okay, it's building. Uh, yeah, I mean, I did, I did lose quite a lot there. It's not the worst case scenario though. Could be much worse. I swear the story is like right there. 
Look at this, this is gonna be so annoying. Oh, oracles? Can we kill them? Let's go. Let's do oracles. Okay. Well, he killed some probes. Not too many. But that means he has no stalkers, right? At home. To, to defend the void race, I think. Let's send the Zealot across the map to kill the pylon that he's uh, proxy target at. I have way less pros than he does. That's my problem. Even though he has a later expansion, my economy is not that great. No, we're looking quite behind. But the Voidways can uh, definitely make a comeback. He has a semi wall off here. We can maybe snipe the pylon powering the gate. Oh, what? I have two Voidways. Why are you coming here for the Oracle? What is this? That's so random, man. That's actually so random. Oh, we can kill this. He has a battery here, but does he have enough? Damn it. God damn it. This is very bad. This is so bad for me. Where's the proxy? Oh, it's here. Oh my god. Okay. I mean, it was still in a good position. Like, it was very hard for me to find it. Well done by my opponent. Go here. With the battery, maybe? Ah, oh, we can kill the probe. There's not enough, like, energy on the battery. For the Oracle. Do you have Blink? You're gonna have Blink soon, right? I killed the Oracle, nice. Get plus one. Okay, that was somewhat successful. The fact that I can keep his uh, Stalkers at home is very good for me. But I cannot expand myself. Like, I'm barely saturated in both of my bases. He's gonna have a lot of Stalkers. I need to see when he's moving out. That's my problem. Let's send the probe forward then. Can I kill something here? Okay, this is good. Blink? Ah, oh, he's gonna have Blink in a moment. Ah, run, run. Okay. He still has uh, Stalkers here. At least it was good scout for me. Okay, double star. Let's get the gases going. I'll keep the probe here, I think. I think it's a good position to... Come on. Give me both side vision. Okay. Nice. Zelos is gonna clear up the Stargate. Now, my problem is going to be taking a third base, for sure. Absolutely. But it's not as bad as it looks, because I did kill some of his probes. The fact that I don't see if he has a third base already done, which I think he does, is a bit problematic, because he could be outlining me here. Then I need to recall. Is he here? He's not making probes. Oh, he was waiting for this. Ah, ah come on. Wasn't calculated, huh, this time. At least he's still there with the stalker, so he does have a third. We need to take this base, I suppose. I don't even have a forge. But this game is looking far worse than the previous one. Mainly because of the freaking oracles, man. They're probably still giving me good vision. Let's get a salad here. We need to saturate this base and like defend it. If I can secure a third base without losing any like my void waste now or economy, like, if he lets me do it freely, this is going to be good for me. <sighs> Come on. He's still not attacking me, which is nice. Force is gonna help. I would like to have a fleet beacon as well, but it's super expensive. And I need both uh, shield batteries and cannons. No, oh, I kind of said pretty much a completed upgrade. That's not good. I'm really surprised that he's not moving out with his stalkers, even though he has blink. Unless he completely dodged me. And I don't see it. Let's get that fleet beacon now. Let's get it. I mean, so far, the, the things are working well. I still haven't died. That's a success. Got a pylon here. I'm gonna need a robo in just a moment as well. I wonder if he's going for, like, phoenixes. Let's see what he's doing. Is he, is he upgrading on the cybernetic score? No. Okay, he's warping in. Oh, he's moving out now. Oh, he has zealots. No. No, 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 no. no. He has charged. He's all inning. I have to recall this. I need everything I need. At home now. Okay, let's go. This is gonna be a hard, hard game. Let's make a full wall so he cannot run in. Come on, cannons, please. Oh, this is going to be tough. Okay, he's moving in like in the next 10 seconds for sure. There we go. Archons. Oh. Well, I, I used everything, that's not good. 
But the Wolof is nice. I don't have that many cannons here. That's a bit of my problem as well. Okay. Got the Archons. Okay, this is nice. This is nice. Look at this. The Wolof is working so much in my favor. Stalkers are losing the fight. Okay, he's splitting the Zealots. That's very interesting. He wants to get the Nexus? He's not gonna get the Nexus. That's... No, that's too expensive. No, no, my friend. My friend. He didn't just, like, sacrifice 90% of his army. For nothing. Let's go Void Race. Okay, let's repeal the Cybernetic Score somewhere else. Can't even get double Cybernetic Score for double upgrades. I'd like to get some... Maybe disruptors now? I mean, his economy is pretty bad. I, I, I cannot make a robotics facility. I lost the cybernetic score, so there's no tech for me. Uh, I still have no recall. Oh, get the prism. No reinforcements for you. Nice. Get the Archon, maybe? Nice, no Archon for you. Please, come on, get it. Get it. Nice. Oh, I lost the Void Ray, but that's okay. I think I need to complete the wall off here. He could be trying to run in with his uh, Zealots again. I just need to save myself here. I should be fine. Can he break me? He cannot, right? I have recall in like six seconds. Let's move out to the Voidus, kill the Nexus, and recall back to the Fend. That's my plan. Got a third star, get in a Robo. Oh, he's moved back. Okay. Never mind. So let's not, let's not complete the wall off. I think he has an Observer. He must have an Observer. Hmm. Okay. Well, the game kind of slows down. It was still a very good defense. Very cost efficient for me. But his economy was not touched by me that much. And I lost complete track of his army. So I need to figure out where he's at. Let's send a probe forward to see um, where he's moving around. Now, the most important part for me is to secure a fourth base. If I can do that, it's going to be great for me. My army should be somewhat stronger than his. Defensively, for sure. Offensively, not really, not yet. Get a battery here. No fourth here. That is interesting. Get a cannon. I'm not sure where, where to move my void is. To be safe. Okay, there's the third. Let's see if he's doing something. Okay, he's making zealots battery. Interesting choice. Get an armor upgrade for the void is as well. We can start making disruptors soon. There's a robot. He's not making any probes, so I think he wants to attack me again. Let's see if he has an observer anywhere. Could be difficult to... Okay, there's the observer. Let's clear it. No more vision for you, my friend. I have a fourth about to be completed. But with pure void race, I don't really have a good position to defend. Okay, he's here. He's here. Moving to the south. Let's go to the right side. I, I can still use recall. If I can keep track of, the, of his army, I can still use recall if I'm in trouble. This observer needs to see where his army is at. Oh, great prism, love it. Uh, but he spotted where my voidists are, so let's just back off. Let's get the fourth uh, base gases. Connect all the voidists. We can start making disruptors in just a moment. Let's start uh, observer speed. Upgrades are about to finish as well. Observer, where's his army at? I don't see his army. A very good void ray count. Oh, he's, okay, I think he's gonna be aggressive again. He's gonna be aggressive. He's moving, right? What's his army? Oh, that's a strong army. Plus two as well. Okay, maybe clear some free units now. Once he's like split now, he's gonna maybe blink forward. No? Okay, we're good. He has an observer here. But I can see his army is on the south side, so I'll just go. Ah, I cannot go. I wanted to like... Uh, snipe the Nexus and recall back. But I cannot do it. Uh, oh, no, no, he's here. He's right there. Okay, but wait, he's backing off. Okay. Free Nexus, sorry, free Archon. He's gonna blink forward, isn't he? No. Okay. I don't know what he, what he was so afraid of. I think he had a better position to fight in. Maybe he didn't have enough uh, army. My Voidus were kind of out of position. Okay, let's move out with the Voidus to the right side then. I saw he's retreating, so let's snipe his fourth. Get some pylons, under the base. We can snipe the base and probably recall if necessary. But I don't see his army being nearby, so we might not even need to... Oh, well, there it is. Okay, well, we're on a full base rate, I suppose. 
Is he gonna recall? He might he might recall. Let's kill his natural then. To take this base. I have the observer so I can see where he's at exactly. Oh. So he's going back with the stalkers and attacking with zealots. Big boom. Big boom. Oh. Go, go, go. Big boom, big boom, big boom. Oh, big boom. Nice. I see where his stalkers are. I saved most of my probes. This observer is giving me so much vision. It's looking good. This is looking good. He again lost like a significant portion of his army, pretty much for nothing. Let's get rid of the forge. Nice, no forge for you. Islands, maybe? You can produce much. And kill this base. We can see this observer is like giving me so much vision. It's so important, PvP. Let's get rid of the Nexus. We can kill the stalkers here, pretty sure. Look at this, they're just disappearing. Okay, go back, go back. He has his entire army here. Plus the battery overcharge. There's no reason to fight there. Just go here, kill everything that he has. Go, go, go. Oh, this is not mining. Uh, where is he with his stalkers? Did I see him come back? He's counterattacking now again, right? He knows he cannot defend me. Oh, shit. Woo! Got a disruptor as well. Big boom. Big boom. Another big boom, maybe? Could be better. No, that's a wasted disruptor shot. Oh, I don't like this. His army is so big here. Ay, 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 ay. We need to go back. We need to go back. He has nothing to go back to. I have. I have batteries. I have cannons. I still have one disruptor shot. No, never mind. Okay, we need to kill some of his units that are all separated. I think combined his army wins, or at least it's very close. So we need to slowly kill his units like this in a good position where his not entire army is fighting. We're gonna blink again, I think. So let's not do that. We need to rebuild the the disruptors, I think. This is not good. Kill the archon, maybe. Yeah, that's fine. Again, his entire army is not fighting. That was a good trade. I still have uh, functioning stargates. Oh, nice, nice. He blinked forward. We can kill some Archons for free. Remember, he lost his like entire economy, so he cannot really produce a lot of his army. This is like his last resort. We can rebuild the Stargates, I suppose. It's fine as well. We can make some cannons, but I don't need to. He's here. His army. I still have a recall available. I cannot defend this base. No way. Okay, let's repower this. Go back to mining. You cannot really break with my this base. Like I think I have a very good setup here. I didn't lose the robot bay either. I make some cannons here, some batteries, and there's no way he can break this, right? This observer. Let's, let's see how much economy he has left. He has a nexus here. I didn't kill. Barely any probes. Oh well, this base. No probes. Okay, so this is all in basically for him. He has to blink forward. He has to blink forward. So I, I don't want him I don't want to allow him that. There we go. I'm trying to fight with a uh, better position. Oh, my voiders are kinda bruised. If I can fight within the battery overcharge, that's gonna be very good for me. Okay, nice. Fight. Okay. Battery overcharge. Oh no, the Archons! Oh my god, I almost lost everything. Oh that was so close. I forgot about the Archon splash damage. Thank god I actually uh Retreated on time. He has no economy. My army is very, very bruised, but he cannot reproduce it. Voidways are faster and have higher range, so I should not lose them to the Archons. If I make a big mistake, I lose. But I have to make a monumental mistake. I don't see how he wins this. He cannot break my base. Oh, wait. What? He cannot break my bases. It's only up to me to, to lose this game now. My opponent cannot have a... Like, he doesn't have a play to win. I just need to not let the Archons connect to the to the Void Race. Or even if they do, like, I can split them. Yeah, that's fine. I have better upgrades. Free one upgrades versus no armor, no shield upgrades. We're fine, we're fine. I still have a very healthy two-base economy for this uh, stage of the game. Yeah, we're cooking, we're cooking. Let's just uh, go on the other side of the map and try to finish the game. We should be winning. Unless his economy was higher uh, than I expected, but I don't think it is. Yeah, no armor upgrades means the Void are winning. GG. What a set of games today. 
even though it was PvPs, I was very, very excited. Oh, he had this base. Okay, so his economy was better than I expected it to be, but it still wasn't good. It, it barely had a full, uh, full mining there. That's cool. That, that was really cool, Proud vs. Spartans. I really thought I'm in deep, deep trouble, but uh, I managed to win thanks to my opponent's uh, poor decision making, or rather, my good defensive positioning. Alright guys, that's going to be it for today's episode of Void Raid Disruptors. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you enjoy this content. And I'll see you on the next episode of Whatever I Have a great rest of the day. Take care and bye-bye.